this is iPhone 11 into the shop for no display if we plug it to the charge it's taking one amp one and a half amp yeah there is no display at all and if we plug the the power supply taking zero amp I'm gonna press the power button see is a uh, 140 milliamp so the phone is boot and like when I press the power button you can see it's the amps is go up then if the screen go uh, in the sleep the amps is gonna go down as now if I press the power button again the amps is it's like the phone is on at the moment but there is no display no backlight if I go to the lights yeah there is no no display at all it's not like just a backlight issue and if we try a good known screen power it on again the amps is going up we have to hold the power button until we see like over 20 milliamp or 200 milliamp like now then is the boot is keep going yeah the power supply shows like the phone is booting fine the amps is good keep going up now almost one amp like yeah I did see one amp is mean the phone is finishing the boot but there is nothing on the screen Yeah, there is no picture at all. Yeah, in this case, like, uh, I have another phone that has a good uh, display, but other issues, but we can get the reading from the display connector and compare it to this one. Yeah, I did alright the the reading. That's the first connector. That's the second connector. Like if you see a difference between uh, the two reading, like is about one is a 0 0.4, the other one is a 0 0.3. That's fine. We look for like if it is one is a 0 0.4 and the other one it show like is shorted to the ground, and one or one it shows 0 0.5 and the other one it show open like big difference so let's uh okay this one this pen here the pen number two it show zero like it shows short to the ground the other one I think is give us a reading yes yeah, give us a point three so let's go to the other side of the connector yeah I'm having this is the stranger reading this pen here 
is a zero and this pen here I have no reading at all okay the other the good display phone so number two yeah that's 0 0.4 and here we have 1.5 so two pins we have different readings so the pin number two let's go to this let's go to this capacitor here and let's go to a component right here then from there it's going to inside the board so let's put some alcohol and see if we can see anything here could be hopefully so I don't have to take the board apart. Power supply set up at uh, one volt. See this one here? It looks like it's moving the alcohol on it. This one right here. That alcohol is moving here. And this capacitor. Well, let's check this capacitor if it's shorted. Can we be lucky with this one? So it's a 0, 0.0 something here. 0, 0.0 something right here. Zero. Zero. Hmm. Likely is the capacitor. Right. Alright, we'll remove that capacitor and let's check to see if we still have any shirt. Oh, that's good. So zero, this side is the ground. This side of the capacitor is open. Let's go to the reading. The pen number two is a zero point two now. That's good. Yeah, look like we get it, but still I need to, to be sure.
yep I see the the battery it fixed we got it to work I'm gonna put it together and at the same time wait for it to to fully charge to charge the battery and uh, power it all right yeah the phone turns on screen works so this all for this video thank you for watching and see you again